My name is Meg Mahalski. I was in a boating accident. She was being pulled in an, on an inner tube behind the boat. And they hit a submerged embankment of a destroyed bridge and it tossed the inner tube in the air and when they impacted a piece of debris, a concrete structure, and that's when Megan unfortunately got the side of her head hit. I was like shaking or like seizing, I guess. Rescue boats came and the ambulance came. I didn't know I was like internally bleeding. When I got to the hospital um, and they did a CT scan, they, the hospital immediately uh, implemented the head trauma protocol and told me that she needed to be life flight helicoptered to UI Children's Hospital and that I needed to get in the car and get down there immediately because it was a life or death situation. When I got there, uh, the, the doctor that I spoke to, I asked, of course, what's the prognosis? What's going to happen? And he told me that um, he couldn't say what the outcome would be, but that her, she was in the best place for her right now. Uh, and knowing that she was at UI Children's Hospital and that that was the best place for her, you know, that relaxed me quite a bit. When we uh, diagnosed uh, uh, this epidural hematoma in Megan, we decided it was necessary to operate on her because these can become life-threatening. Although it was small, we still believed it was life-threatening enough and we took her to the operating room upon admission and she had what we call a craniotomy. A craniotomy consists of an incision in the scalp, an incision in the skull for the evacuation of the clot. As a result of this operation, actually she did quite well. She recovered uh, remarkably well. Uh, and that was really what saved her life. They were able to get in and do that quickly. Fortunately, you know, being at UI Children's Hospital, she was able to have that treatment immediately and to get that situation resolved. The professionalism, you know, the, the technology we have in general, but then having them apply it there the way they did, as well as the human care too. I don't think it could have been done better in any other facility. Since her injury, she joined a, an extreme uh, kickboxing course. She's also done uh, soccer in her high school. She's in cross country and does very well in, in those areas. She wouldn't be with us today if, if she hadn't been treated at UI Children's Hospital. And that's the bottom line. That, that's the reality. That is the place you want to be, whether it's a traumatic injury or whether it's a more routine situation. The care that your child will get at UI Children's Hospital is incomparable to any other facility. It's, it's exceptionally good. UI Children's Hospital stands for exceptional care. In our situation, it stands for a miracle yeah. because that's what we got out of the treatment that Megan received. We got our child back. We had a miracle that happened uh, because of the treatment she received.